This show is a platform to do exactly what we just did was to communicate with you, Chicago, let you know about the organization and what we have to offer as far as uh, uh, social services or employment um, or just being a part of our family. Uh, but I also use this, this show as a way of highlighting vendors who do well. And my next guest is just one of those individuals. You know, streetwise, we do not discriminate. We have all kind of people who come through our doors because we have open door policy. Um, all kind of people. And th my next guest is very, very special to the streetwise family. Well, let me tell you something about it. She was born and raised in Wisconsin and Chicago. She attended Jefferson High School in Wisconsin. Now, she's worked at Co Shop Co and at the Shelter Workshop for two years, okay? Um, she's been with our Streetwise organization for a couple of years now. Uh, as time moved on, she got very, very experienced, and right now she's really, really loving her job and loving what she does. I'd like to welcome to the show Streetwise Street Scene, Miss Gabby Carroll. Gabby, welcome to the show. How you doing? Uh, all right. How are you? I'm very, very blessed. You know, I'm very happy to have you on the show. And you I'm know, happy to be here. You, are you happy to be here? I'm glad to have you. Uh, we were talking about job opportunity, okay? Um, first, how did you find out about Streetwise? Um, I, I was going to the red line, and Leonard, a Streetwise vendor, was there, mm -hmm. and um, he. Uh, he said, I'm going to to Streetwise, do you want to come with me? Mm -hmm. I'm like, yeah. So I went through the training and I went th through the orientation. So big shout out to Leonard. What's up, Leonard? For, big shout out to you, my brother. For helping. Okay, so, you know, it's been it's been two years. Um, you know, one of the things that I find is very special about you is as I watch you through the two years overcome adversity, you know, it's, it's no secret in our family that you do have a, a disability. Um, what, what, kind of, what, what kind of disability do you have? I have mild cerebral palsy, mild mental retardation, and a hint of mental illness. He says in a, in a, in a hint. And, 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 and through all of that, huh. you do not let nothing get you down. I mean, you are a, a, a definitely a trooper. And, and to watch you overcome all that, um, to come to work on a daily basis and get that job done really, really, you know, makes me proud to have you as, as a streetwise vendor. Um, you know, and just like how a lot of things starts kind of to get adjusted, at the point of two years in the game, I mean, you out there working on a daily basis. What do you like most about being a streetwise vendor? I love all my customers. You love all your customers? So do you do you like going to work every day? I do. Now, before you came to school, did you ever try to find any other kind of job? Yes, I applied at Jewel. I applied at Target. I applied at... Um, Some other places, too? Did you, have, did you get hired? No. And so, and then you came to Streetwise, and you started work the very first day, didn't you? So you like doing it, like being a part of the organization. Yeah. And you know what? We love having you. Um, one of the things you say you like to, is, is your customers, the support they give you. Uh, where do you sell your magazines at? Irving Park and Kedzie. And what days of the week do you sell them? Monday through Friday from eleven. Till about seven. So the strengths, you know, it, it, what you do and what all our vendors do, I mean, it's it's not an easy job, you know. Uh, what are some of your strengths as far as getting a job done and on a daily basis? Um, just like uh, getting up, going to work, um, getting excited about work and what I do and now you know we always talk about somebody says no today may say yes tomorrow but if you're not there how are they going to buy the magazine from you 
Um, I know you, you've had some people that said no to you before, right? Right. And those same people, they eventually started to buy the magazine from you. Right. Uh, do, do your customers stop and they talk to you and ask you questions and then mm-hmm. um, just like to associate with you? Yep. Now, you know, as far as the, the family, would you consider Streetwise though a family though? Cause yes, I do. You do. And you're definitely part of the family. What are some of the things you like, in, not just in the streets and working, but, you know, in the office there? Uh, I like socializing. <laughs> we definitely yeah. know that. And that's been a, a great platform for you to do that. And you told me, you say, Greg, make sure I'm able to, you know, thank some people. So I want you to have this opportunity right now to thank some of the people that supported you. I mean, the facility where you okay. live at and, you know, on the streets. So here's your opportunity. Uh... Thank you to my grandparents and my mom and Greg. <laughs> You're welcome. And um, all my other friends who supported me and helped me. Well, Chicago, today we have it. We have Gabby Carroll. Streetwise vendor, not up and coming, but established streetwise vendor. Uh, we we gave her the opportunity, but you the one that made it happen. There's some people who who's tried to do it, but they just couldn't really hang. I bet you probably the only person from your orientation class is probably still here, right? Right. And we talked about the the, the ones that would probably hang and the ones that probably would fall off. And you definitely have hung in there. I'm so proud of you. Um, and you know, just a spark, your spark, and you're a very good example of how streetwise can. Give people opportunities who realistically might get them anywhere and, you know, be able to create their own destiny. And it's all about becoming self-sufficient. And self-sufficient means you don't have to depend on no one, right? Right. you you be able to make your own money. Right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yo, we don't want to thank Gabby for being on our show. Uh, next week, we're going to have an awesome show in Chicago. I want to thank KNT for giving us the opportunity. Uh, you like to get more information, don't forget to check out our website, streetwise.org. Until next week, Chicago, stay focused, keep it real. Stay streetwise. Peace out, Chicago.